Hello everybody, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you may be. How you all doing today folks? Welcome along to the live stream with myself, Simulation for the Nation. Before we go too far, let's say hello to those who are watching right now. We've got Steven Nesbitt, Edward Jackson, what's going on guys? Hello, Nightmare Speed QB, hello, hello, how are you? Farming Life is a teen, two and all videos, hello, Rodri, Evans, Jim Bob, Jack, Steven, Milton's here, Gamer Dragon, hello sir, how are you? Two days in a row, right? I know, well... It will be two days and then that'll be it, I think. Uh, my schedule is back to crazy as of tomorrow. Uh, so I thought I'd sneak, well actually as of about 3pm this afternoon, but uh, I thought I'd sneak in a little uh, live stream now. Uh, King Scorpion, what's going on bud? How you doing? Sam Guns here, Logan, hello, Paul Cox, Richard Nicholas and Adrian Moore, hello guys. How are you all doing today? What's going on? Can I get an audio check before we go too far please? That would be wonderful. And then we are... Get us into here, like a soul. Beautiful stuff. So, back into my game as well, that would help. We, what have we been doing? Well, from yesterday, we progressed a little bit. There's a shed here now. That wasn't there yesterday. Uh, that's first and foremost. Doing very well, thank you, Paul Cox. Very well indeed, yeah. Uh, getting myself all sorted out there. Hey, Martins, welcome along. Everything seems good. Thank you, King Scorpion and Rodri. That is fantastic. So yeah, we have uh, we started to get some bales in. Uh, exhibit A bales. Uh, we're gonna the field has no more bales in there from the field that we were in yesterday. So what we will do is get the combine away there shortly. Uh, in fact, what we'll go and do we'll go and run the tractor and trailer out. We'll get the combine going, and then that could just be left to its own devices. And we can, uh, we can get that field knocked out pretty quickly. I did change around and I found out the issue I was having yesterday was that, if I jump over here, was that, uh, there we are. Cosplay at the moment doesn't like certain bits of equipment, cultivators namely, that also have like a seed drill attachment on the back. So that's why we swapped to this one. Hey, Farmer Dunn, I'm doing very well, thanks bud, how are you? Hey Brian, welcome along. What's going on, how are you doing today? Good to know, Farming Life. Good to know. Uh, so, let's just get this guy up and working again. Do, 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 do. Uh, where are we? Blended. Does that make sense? Is he going the right way? I'd say yes. Cool. I can leave him just to do his thing. Vision 1 of uh, Sutton GD. Uh, if that's the question, then yes, I didn't change it. Uh, the reason I didn't change it is because I started to do a lot of my own tweaks, let's say. And I didn't really want to go back in and do that again. Case man, what's up bud? Welcome on board. How are you doing today? Disconnect field again because uh, it didn't complete last time and it left quite a few bits missing. So I'm uh, tidying it up I think is probably fair. Fair uh, kind of categorization of what we're doing. You can go. I don't need you. You can just do your thing there please combine. Well thank you. Is the map coming up to Xbox and PS? Uh, at the moment that it is not it is only on PC, but you never know that could one day change Ah uh, yes me and my tweet exactly GD exactly I'd like to make the map a little different Can you do bail work? We are going to be doing some bail work. We're just going to be um, We're getting the combine away first. We've got those bales to stack uh, in the corner and then We'll get the bailer out, we'll get this field done, all being well. Oh, that's a bit, bit busy. And we'll stick this over here for now. So, we'll just... Like I say, we started unloading. This auto-loader trailer, by the way, um, I noticed that this appeared on 
few sites of late. This is an auto load trailer, so it stacks them all on there by themselves and you can lock them down. But it's a really nice trailer, very much enjoy that. Can get a bit heavy though, so you might want a big tractor on that. Hey Stefan, welcome along, hello gaming, Matt, welcome along, how are we all doing guys? Let's go off the back here. No, I'm not sure, they might have auto locked themselves down again. Yes, they have. Thank you, Doki. It's a huge trailer. It's great to get that many bales on there. Huh? Put this little placeable shed in here as well, just because I ran out of kind of space. I didn't know where I was putting everything. Needed somewhere, somewhere new. Hey, Tino, what's going on? How you doing? Irish farmer, hello, bud. What's going on? I also had to prune a few trees to get this to work here, but it's uh, it's in. That's the main thing. There's a Flegel one floating around also. Yeah, the Flegel one is, uh, it's okay. I don't like it as much as this one. This one's a little more heavy duty, I think would be the crush into a gate. Damn it, GD, that's your fault. Hey, Sim Gaming, welcome, welcome. Ian Roberts, how's it going? Welcome along. What's new with you? Adaboo! What's up? Welcome in. Great news, King Scorpion. Thanks for that. Cosplay tutorials are going to ramp up in severity uh, and difficulty as we kind of go along. So right now we're just doing the basics. Uh, tonight we have seed in coming out, which will be quite a good one. Uh, so that's seed in and fertilizer and the difference is there. Tomorrow we're going to have one about harvesting and using multiple harvesters. And after that we're going to get into the depths of kind of traveling along road, emptying from grain carts and all that good stuff as well. So um, if, that, if you ever have any questions, do drop them in the comments for the cosplay videos and I will do my best to uh, answer them and help you out where possible. Oh, don't you dare. Don't you dare. Hey, Farmer Klein. Welcome along. How you doing, bud? Nice to see you in here. It's been a while. Mind that big shed. Less of that, GD. When I, in 17, I didn't really rate this bale fork, but when I started to use it properly in 19, I actually really like it. Do I have a link for cosplay? Uh, not on me right now, no, actually. I should... If you go to the easiest way, actually, it's kind of been distributed along all the mod sites, but if you go to Google and type in Farming Simulator 19 Cosplay GitHub, G-I-T-H-U-B, it will uh, give you everything you need there. Hey, Breeze Gaming, what's up? Welcome along, bud. How's it all going? Do you think GPS will ever come to console? If I had to say one of the two, I think GPS is more likely than cosplay, uh, simply because of its complexity. But uh, yeah, I am not sure. We'll have to wait and see on that front. Away from that. There we go. Hey, Callum Matthew, we are playing on Sutton Farm today. Although this is my version of Sutton Farm, it's a little bit different, a few new buildings and places, but it is still Sutton Farm. 
if you have yet to download Sutton Farm, uh, it is available in a few places. I know if you check out Virtual Farmer's uh, Discord, there is a link in there for it, which I believe is still active. And it's also active on a few different mod sites at this stage. I need to give it a bit of a tap. Uh, yes, yeah, so we'll just push those up. Yes, push. Ah, uh, do you know that's a great question? Uh, Mine is this default, I haven't touched my field of view, so I, uh, whatever the in-game default is, let's put it that way. I'm actually getting more and more, oh you dare. Ugh. It's always one. I'm getting more and more uh, hooked on something the more I play actually these days. Can't quite put my finger on why, but yeah, I really do like it. That wasn't even me, I'm almost sure it wasn't. It just kind of happened. See if we can get that all squared up. They're away. I would say there's a lot to be said for the round bale physics on FS19. They are very good. Uh, the square bale physics, not so much sometimes. No, I'm not. No, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> yes. I'm so pleased I saved that. Heavens. Hey, Paul, what's going on? I'm doing very well, thank you, buddy. Very well indeed. What's the blame game? <laughs> Thanks. I, I thought it was a mighty fine save there. Appreciate the, the love there, guys. Um. There we go. <laughs> Gav, it's like a call-in. The second you arrive. How are you doing, buddy? What's going on? Oh, it's all gone to pot now, folks. I know, it's a combination of GD and Gav. The second they're in there together, things it's like the perfect storm of terrible play. I'm also getting a little bit... I'm going to have to start changing the angle we're coming in here, I think. Hey, Witchy, how are you doing? That's Mother Ketchog! Welcome along. You did nothing. <laughs> okay, let's just uh, pull this back a touch. What I can't do though is be careful about uh, trying to auto load those. Because if I try and auto load those, this could pull all the bales out the back of the shed. Thank you, Farmer Klein. I appreciate that. We're nearly there. It's rather exciting. Uh, if I had a little bit more, a few more hours in the day, I'd make a little special uh, thing, and I may still tomorrow. Uh, but yeah, I can't wait. It's going to be awesome. Around this time last year, end of January, I uh, really ramped up my channel, and I was on uh, about 330-ish subs at this time last year. So that's uh, nuts to think about. 
How many bells have you got in that shed? Uh, that's a good question. I think I'm getting close to 60 right now. That bell trailer carries 33. Um, so yeah, roughly coming on 60. Which is not bad. Doesn't help when I keep doing stupid things like that, of course. But you know, no one's perfect. Beautiful. Quick cube! Yeah, just a few. There's a few more to go. We're only halfway through that field as well, so... Uh, yeah, there's a few more to get stacked in. We'll get them. We'll get them. Well, the thing I might do, just... To save mine and everyone else's sanity, is just start stacking them this way now. Hey Nathan, what's up bud? How's it going? Oh, uh, and I've dropped some more. Good stuff. What we'll do, we'll leave this here for now. We'll go in... Just kick this trailer back. Oh, I can't even see to reverse the thing. Hey Dal, didn't see you creep in there bud. What's going on? How are you? Uh, let's just swing this over here. This trailer, I got it on Forbidden Mods, but it is available on a few different websites. Uh, Farming Simulator uh, 19 mods, I think. Uh, probably, probably Mod Hoster, but that website doesn't work all too well. Uh, and I also found it on FS17.LT, so it's it's around. It's it is definitely around. 700 bells every summer, quick cube. Jeez, that's pretty impressive. Let's just get this hooked up to here. The reason I, I kind of chose this baler more than, or this trailer, sorry, more than the Flegel trailer is just because it's a little bit more solid. It's a little bit more robust and I like that. And it's, it does have an auto load script on it as well, which is always nice. Got a Renault 640 RS for your birthday last week. I don't have a good Renault to get, unfortunately. I like a good Renault tractor. I haven't seen any good ones yet. But happy birthday for last week. You need solid with the amount of things you hit. Well, that is rude and accurate simultaneously, GD. I like things built to last. And then I try and destroy them by hitting them all the time. Why, well, whenever I watch the uh, the farming simulated bale tournament, I was always think, yeah, that'd be quite good. And I would probably get about ninety percent of the way through it and be on fire. And then I'll, with one slight incorrect movement of something, I'd end up just destroying my entire work. Alexander, Bale Trailer is available on a couple of different locations. Uh, I think it's on Forbidden Mods right now, and it is also on um, a couple of different websites, such as FS17.LT has it, but I think I got it from something like Farming Simulator 2019 Mods, or something to that effect. Hey Carl, what's going on bud, how you doing? You're doing up a one for a plow? Oh, nice, Callum. You were uh, going to do any plowing championships with it? This game makes you vexed. I'll tell you what, anything with round bales now is much better than it ever was. 
We have three JCB loaders, two class tractors, two John Deere's. Oh, nice quick cubed. Nice little setup you got yourself there. I must say, I typically find it easier to stack square bales with a front loader than I do telehandler. Uh, but yeah, my default is to always go for telehandler. Uh, this one is probably the hardest out of them all, but uh, I always end up picking the articulated ones. Is that because of the tree branch there? Probably. All right, so we're gonna leave you there. Do you go to the farm show? I used to, yeah. I used to go to the Highland show uh, quite a lot when I was back in the UK. Uh, let's go and see what the combine's doing. Every time. Do you have a wheel and side pole? Not yet, no, I wish I did. I am using the Xbox One controller, a wired one. Uh, but no, I really wish I did. Eric Alma, I've just noticed you subscribed. Thank you ever so much for subscribing, my friend. Really do appreciate that. Welcome along. Matt F Simulation, what's going on, buddy? How you doing? Okay, 1100 acres, nice quick cube. I'm only paid in FSU at the end of 17, which made your own bills behave normally. Oh. I always find with the cycle of uh, FS games that there's always a nice little mod that appears that can do something pretty cool. Um, and it always comes around the end of you know the end of the this. Oh, missed that entirely. The end of the the, the version, uh, but then it takes a while to reappear. This is pretty much going to fill this up. I'm doing very well, thanks Matt. How are you doing today? No more, I see. Not yet, I don't think, no. Those Giants team are working hard on that, I'm sure. You ever go to Lama? I didn't, Arch, you know. Lama was always a bit too far south for me. Uh, living in the very north, it was always easier to go to somewhere like the Highland Show, but I never really went down to Lama. You are not wrong, Quick Cube. You are not wrong. David7810, hello, bud. What's going on? How are you today? Thanks for stopping by. Uh, okay, so. Catch you later, FK. Thanks for stopping by, bud. Yeah, you too. It's getting uh, pretty cold up this way. Oh, nice, Richard. There you go. Stage one. This is a T6, Adibu. This is the stock in game. T6175, we've got here. You know what, I, I really do like FS19. There are a lot of things that need to be fixed with it on, from the initial launch, but Giants are getting around to that, but I love it. To the point where the other day I was on uh, TeamSpeak talking to Landy on there, and we were, uh, I was looking through old thumbnails of videos from FS17, and it's night and day difference. It is incredible. Just finished the Forts and Dexter. Oh, nice, Callum. That's a good rig. We're going to let him get himself turned around. I'm still not quite sure why he's not filling his head up. But... And then once we get this tipped, we can get the baler out as well. And we'll get cracking here. Oh, good. I'm just looking out my window. It's snowing again. Fantastic. How much have I been playing FS19? It's a good question. Uh, I downloaded it directly, so I couldn't tell you the number of game hours. Uh, but it'll be quite high at this stage. Definitely would be quite high. Uh, yeah, Jim Bob, we, ha we didn't have a great deal last night. We had about two and a half, three inches, I would say. But it's supposed to snow all day today as well, so... Uh, we'll see. 
at this stage it's just apparently according to the local news uh, where I live in Canada in the middle of Ontario we have had a little bit over a little bit under one meter of snow in January so it's just a lot there we go Edwin welcome along buddy how are you I do quick tube yeah well I do now yeah Do I farm myself? Not anymore. I uh, used to once upon a time, uh, about 12 years ago. I used to work on the family farm. I'm doing very well, thank you, Edwin. What's going on, Seth? How are you doing? Welcome to the stream, hope all is well. I live in Devon, oh nice. Never really been down to Devon for too long. Console players really need a new map, yeah. Now I know that there are a few, there's three in testing right now with Giants apparently. One of which is Marwell Manor, Oxygen David's. Uh, there is a forestry map, I don't know much about. And there's also a map from the Swiss Alps, I believe. So they are coming. Uh, I, th I would like to hope that Giants have got those as kind of a priority somewhere. Um, I would have no idea if they do or not. Oh, missed my entrance. Oh, I put another shed here as well. Which I just, I wanted to show you so much that I thought I'd crash into it. Uh, that is going to be for a secondary storage. You need to do the train there, but that's going to be for more bales. Richard, you're nearly there. That sounds great. SMD Digital Channel Android phone download. Oh, that'd be pretty cool. Hey, Farmer Jimmy, nearly missed you there. What's going on, bud? How are you? Welcome to the stream. Yeah, it's funny. I used to live in London for quite a while, and uh, like an inch of snow there grinds London to an absolute standstill. This level of crashing at 5 p.m. <laughs> Jeremy, you're not wrong. I, um, yeah. There's no, no excuse for that one. I just got excited by my uh, shed. Need three more maps? Yeah, I would say that's a, a good number. And I know a lot of like the European-based community and the UK community don't really enjoy them, but there's some interesting-looking German maps, uh, American maps out there. Sorry, look really good. Where am I from, Carl? Uh, I, right now, I live in Ontario, Canada, but I am originally from the very north of the UK, very north of England. What time are you streaming to? I will be streaming until Mr. Rainbow Dave goes live, which is usually around 5 p.m. GMT. Uh, let's see if he um, if he goes live back on the dot, then I will call it a day. If he's running a little bit behind, I will keep going. You're from Estonia. Welcome. That's awesome. You may well be my first Estonian viewer. I, has everyone tried the Fent 1050 that came up yesterday onto the mod hub? That's quite nice. Like it that it's got a uh, manually opening doors. All right, combine. You get around there. How not much mill left? Well, we're over halfway. It's crazy. Look at the size of field 2. It's nowhere near one of the biggest fields on the map. But with this combine, it's taken me forever. Ooh, Jeremy, that would be a good map to have across. Based off of how good uh, Gwenthua was originally, the quality there could be incredible to see. Am I watching football later? I sadly will not be. I'm... Um, I'm working a night shift today, so I won't be watching any football. Poor me. 
Oh. Hey, Mock Monday! Welcome along, bud. How you doing? Paul, I would tend to agree. Um, you know, some people like forestry and fair play to them. I myself get just infuriated by it, and I can't do it. Hey, LG, I don't anymore. No, I used to work on a farm. Excuse me, used to work on a farm up to about uh, ten years ago. Longer the better, live your streams. Thank you very much, Paul. Appreciate that one. Sadly, my next stream won't be until Sunday, but what we'll probably do is have a nice long one on Sunday. Um, what we're going to do, we're going to get up to... Let that combine go almost to the edge where we'll get another load. We'll go and take this away, and then we'll bring the baler out. I think as well we can put the we've got a Vardestad drill we can put onto the Ford and that or the new Holland T7 and that can go and drill that field over there, making some great progress. So we're just gonna might as well get this filled up here. Makes sense to. There we go. Away! Like spike! I approve! Let's have a like spike. If you've yet to do so already, do smash that like button. It's really appreciated. Helps the YouTube algorithms push my streams around a bit. Uh, I think. I believe that's how it works. It's either that or it kicks the uh, internet fairies into doing things they're supposed to do. One of those two. What's my dream? That's quite a deep question, uh, Carl. Uh, I have no idea, really. I, I've always had multiple. In an ideal world, it would be that I'd be in a position where I didn't have to work and I could just sit and uh, live stream and play, uh, play various different games all day. No worries, Jim Bob. Catch you in a bit. Hey, Bob Tag 75, Bob Tag 75. Welcome along, bud. How you doing? Clearing trees and making fields. Hey, that's not a bad idea, GD. I like that. Mr. Maxim 629. Welcome along. I've missed my entrance, haven't I? No. How's it going? Mr. Jingles is here as well. Hello, buddy. Welcome. Don't crash into the shed. Don't crash into the shed. There. 53 people watching, that is awesome. Thank you everybody who's stopped by today. Welcome along, if you've just joined in. I mean, how have I even... There you go. Oh, awesome, thank you, Witchy. That's very kind of you. If you are new into the stream, don't be shy, do say hello. Love to know where you're watching from as well. Like this field here, 14, that's gonna take forever. What is this map? Nobby Tini, this is uh, Sutton Farm. Why have you stopped there? Why? This is available in a few places if you search in the right areas. Uh, you can still download this one. It is quite a good British map. I really like it. But my wheels have magnets. <laughs> it depends, uh, farm and life. It all depends on what your specifications for your laptop are really uh, because it might not be able to run it very well do i play ets2 i do occasionally yeah I'm in my spare time i um i once thought about making a series like a let's play on it but just didn't know how i would be able to i'd be able to make it work properly really river I'm just going to leave that one there. 
How many bells have we got in here? Okay. I want to get that one tidied up. We'll kind of sh shove that one down there a little bit. Do you think Mike Ashley should get out of Newcastle? Oh, Paul, do not get me started on that, man. That is not a fun conversation. Such a depressing time. And I am super worried about what's going to happen for the rest of this year. Please do make an ETS series. Um, I always think about it. That's the thing. I always try and figure out a way we could do it differently or to make it... Because it's not like on, you know, Farm Sim or any of the simulation game you, like where you can get out and walk around and do different things. You kind it's difficult to make fresh content on uh, on Euro Truck. Yeah, I tell you what, Pretzel's got some good music on it at the moment. Maybe it's just because I haven't been on it for a while. So yeah, what we'll do, we will, before we get the bail, I'm going to check on what the new Holland's doing. That's probably the position where I can just stick the drill onto there. Good idea. Yeah, turn up the music, I can probably give it a little bit of a bump. How's that for everyone? What fence is that? This fence here is... Where's it gone? This is, uh, it's classified as the mod, it's the eight, uh, 800 favorite, but it comes in a whole variety of different sizes. Uh, let me just turn down the music in my headphones. Uh, so if I go on to medium tractors, this is it here. Uh, it's the 800 favorite. I got this off of Forbidden Mods uh, and also FS17.LT has it as well, I do believe. Uh, you can change it from an 816 to a 916 to a 920 as well, but crucially, check out in there when you change it, the, uh, the gear gearbox configurations change as well. Are you going to do a, a Return to Dairy Man's Diary on Meadow Grove? Do you know what? I've, I've been thinking about this a lot and I, it does look like it's something that we'll need to do. Uh, where are you? Oh, you've, you've finished there, but you haven't. Uh, but yeah, I, I certainly do like the idea of Return to Meadow Grove. I'm looking forward to it. If Nathan's still here, it is looking fantastic. I know he's working away on it when he can. I have to see if Frank's going to make a return. We'll just tidy up this little bit. 50 people watching! That is wonderful news. Thank you everybody who has just joined in. Hashtag bring back Frank. That's the dream. There's more here than I thought. Let's just go down. Those fence do sound really good, don't they? Like superb. And you can almost make them sound like they're double clutching as well, which is always quite nice. But they sound good when they're pulling the load. Um, do you know what? We're not going to do all of this. We'll just do this little pass up here. We've got 40 likes already. That is fantastic as well. I really do appreciate that, each and every one of you. It's always great to see. We'll be going for at least another 20 minutes at this rate, uh, depending upon what Mr. Rainbow Dave is doing. Has anybody seen or heard of him from uh, his Discord this morning? Is he up? Good 
Big shout out to who has just, whoever that is who has just subscribed, I'm sorry, it looks like it is in Russian and I cannot read that, I'm afraid. But welcome along, thank you ever so much for joining. Do I not feel that? I do. Oh. We get a big corn harvest going at some point. Cool, thanks Witchy. If you just keep me posted, that'd be sweet. So once I finish my live stream today, I've got I've already recorded a cosplay tutorial for tomorrow. Uh, that needs to be uploaded. I need to get tomorrow's Forgotten Farms episode up and working where we're starting on with the harvest. Uh, and then I might even try and record another track driver, and then we'll be good. Is he delayed by a corned beef sandwich? <laughs> that's quite, that's funny. Alright then, we're just going to sling this down here somewhere. No worries, Witchy. Thanks for stopping by. Catch you later, Bob Tag. Uh, this can just go to here. Drills around here somewhere. Get that all stuck on. I do like this Valstad drill. I like the fact that Giants went through and edited all of the uh, original kind of equipment from previous versions and just remade the models there and made them just look fantastic. Really, really have. What I need, and what I don't have here, is seed, so... Hey, CD! What's going on, bud? How you doing? We're just gonna kinda park this here somewhere, and we're gonna go and nip over to the store, grab a couple of bags of seed, that should get us rolling at least. Throw that down as well. We need to follow me and manual attach Steven, you are not wrong. Uh, quickly, what happened to the family farm? A couple of things really. A um, couple of retirements in the family. And uh, we were at the point where some of the farms just were a little bit... Uh, we had three farms, so we uh, decided once a couple of retirees that it wasn't really viable to work on its own. So we called it a, called it a day there. Oh, I've left my fail ha fire handler. Don't pick that up. Follow me. Manual touch is something I don't think I've missed too, too much. I can get by as we are. It's nice, but I can get by. Um, I'm more pleased that we have things like... Um, uh, we have like uh, dynamic hoses as standard now. That's huge. Um, but GPS is what I'm really missing. GPS and then follow me of it for certain tasks is crucial. Yeah, I don't know why they did that GD. I don't know if it was like from they had to consider what was on the like a disc for the disc version of the game if they just couldn't fit everything on. I don't know. I mean, it's nice to have them back. It's a shame that we have to get them in mods. 
because uh, I'm sure it's blocking the pipeline for, uh, like, look at CD models here with 4D Modern. I'm sure there's a lot of mods that he's waiting to get progress through. Loving the looks of that trailer, by the way, uh, CD. That looks really good. Uh, big bag seed. We'll start with two. The VCA mod has GPS built into it basically. What is VCA? Bradley, what's going on bud? How are you doing today? slow with giants I can imagine I can imagine how many mods have you got in testing with them now hey Brendan welcome along bud how you doing nice to have you on board and fully full on GPS but steering lock and locks to the oh vehicle control mod I will have a look at that oh they're a bit a bit mobile. Seemed quite right. But I've been testing now. Hey, that's awesome, CD. That's really, really good. Have any of them progressed? Have any of them been kind of looked at yet? Or are you still pending? This could be good, what we'll do. Oh, cool. So at least we're getting to some of them. That's good news. There you go. Love a good photo. Do I have an Instagram calendar? Do you know what I do? I just haven't really updated it a great deal of late. Um, it's something that I keep meaning to get onto, but uh, as of, I've only just started to reproduce content again following the festive period in the last kind of two weeks, so uh, watch this space on that one. Mini Corn Dog, what's up, bud? I like that, um, I like that sound of vehicle control mod, I'll have to have a look. That's fair enough, Archie, that is fair enough. Make sure I've got, uh... Oh. Oh, I can imagine CD, yeah, but you just want them out there now. Mm -mm -mm -mm. We're back in field 15, aren't we? Let's just load in. That nearly crashed, that was weird. Let's just uh, have another look at that. Currently, in lovely, 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 lovely.
Bit northeast. Seems a bit weird there, so we'll just do it manually. Good. Awesome mini corn dog. I will check that one out. How big? Uh, combined, it was just about a thousand acres between three. Give or take. Uh, I'm sure we're gonna have to go and empty the combine. Yeah, four yards, that's pretty cool. Okay, I'm gonna have to jump in there and move that out quickly. What's this tipper? This is a PTS 11, it's called. Um, again, available, I found this on Forbidden Mods, which I'm using quite a lot of late. Uh, but it's the first kind of small tipper I found, uh, and I really do quite like that. Hey, Adrian and Amy Pudu, welcome. How are you doing, guys? Good to hear. So we've we've got quite a bit done so far actually, given that we've only been going for about 50 minutes. Uh, we're going to let's see what we'll do. We'll tip this load first. Then we'll uh, once we've tipped the load out, we will go and um, get the baler in here. I think get that fence working on the baler. Get this all wrapped up. 700 beef and commercial limousine cows. Wow, that's a lot. 3,000 sheep. Evans. You're going to be kept busy. Jill Agri, what's going on, buddy? How you doing? Welcome aboard. Excellent stuff. We'll get this tipped. Lamin season starts next week. Yeah, suppose you've got 3,000 uh, to lamb, you're going to have to get through them pretty quickly. You have to start a little bit earlier to spread them out a bit, I guess. Okie dokie, around here we go. I used to hate lamb in season. God, it's torturous. You always just have to spend far too much time stuck driving around on a quad bike trying to find sheep in the wet and the cold and bringing them in. Never used to get warm. What's them on the bottom corner of the HUD? Oh! With the little, uh, the one that's flashing now, that one, that is enhanced vehicle control. Uh, so as you can see in the HUD at the top, you've got tipper uh, and tractor, and you've got a whole load of different percentages. It's kind of like a very primitive version of drive control. Uh, and what this does is it allows me to put on the uh, lock or open the diffs. Uh, that, when that yellow line is on, that's four-wheel drive as well. I did place this Bradley, yeah, so I placed both the um, the hopper and the shed and put a little tree board around it as well. I'm doing well, thank you GL. Oh, I'm crashing into that Doing very well. Getting some time put in on FS, which is always pleasant. I love how fast I'm booting it along this dirt track. Uh, 
I uh, help a sheep farmer, and here's a Justin for Lab no, Nice, Jim Bob. No problem, farmer done. No problem at all. Okay, so we're gonna leave this about here. Uh, up into the mighty vent. Hang on, hang on. Just to go off what we were discussing previously. Turn that music right down. Back into here. Listen to that! Beautiful. Really do like the sound of that thing. Uh, yeah, we took that big shed into a lemon shed. Luckily, it's one of the, of the yard. Oh, night. <laughs> you don't, yeah, getting up, uh, working through night shift on lemons. Miserable. No worries, GL. Thanks for stopping by, bud. Have yourself a great rest of your day. I need to think about getting this clean soon. The sound of this vent when it's under load is very nice. Biggest field's 40 acres. That's not too bad though. That's not too bad at all. It's gonna be a lot of bales off here. We took 66 bales off here from two loads on that big trailer. And we maybe got about a quarter of it done. So we're gonna be doing well off here. I don't know where I'm gonna put them all, but that's another issue. What's my PC specs? So right now, I am running a GTX 1070 Ti, a gigabyte. I have I have a bit of a special home build computer where I use a, a Lenovo S30, uh, which is a, like an enterprise rig. Um, and I have 16 gig of RAM in here at the moment as well. With my SSD is about 500 gig, I think as well. So, um, but my processor is in the realms of about a two point. Uh, no, it's just a, it's a 3.2 beg your pardon gigahit, 3.2 processor, and it handles FS swimmingly. How big are the fields around me? Ah, uh, well here in Canada they are huge, monstrously big. Really need to get that old uh, that combine emptied out. We'll look at that in a little bit. In yesterday's stream, Landy had an issue where his uh, the grain tank just closed on him. That was a bit weird. When will Nathan's map be out? Uh, I don't know. It's still in testing at the moment, or still being finished before it goes into testing properly, even as I should say. Um, so he's still working on last few little bit. Shouldn't be too long though. You're saving up to upgrade the looks of my PC. Nice. Uh, I will be done as soon as Mr. Rainbow Dave starts. So I'd imagine he's going to be starting 
uh, momentarily. So we've probably not got too much longer left at all. Yeah, as soon as he is, uh, as soon as he goes on to his timer, then we'll probably call it quits. Uh, what job do I do in Canada? I'm actually not allowed to say. It's a secret. Performance time, but not looks great. Ah, you know, you can always slowly improve that. That's not a bad idea. My machine looks. Uh, it's a, I've gone for like a kind of a stealth one, so it's got a very boring, dull-looking uh, tower, um, and um, with all of the mighty power hidden inside, it's great. Will Metal Grove be on console? Uh, I think it's Nathan's hope that it will be. Uh, it's gonna go to Giants for testing, and then we'll see how it goes from there. But yeah, he is hoping to get it onto console. That's uh, last time I spoke to him, at least. Guessing your Santa. <laughs> Shh, GD. Don't give it away. If you went back into farming, what would you do? Oh, I'd be, I'd be more than happy just to sit on a nice uh, massy. Uh, put me into a seventy-seven eighteen and just let me work. Just give me a, a variety of different jobs, and I'd go out there and do them. I don't know, Stephen. Well, that's a good question. I'm getting a 360 mil AIO, new motherboard, 16 gigs of RAM. Nice! It's a good setup. Alright, so we'll take this swath out of here, then we'll just go and pull in the old, uh, pull in the new Holland, we'll get that all loaded up, get this John Deere combine rolling again. Oh, listen to that sound. I'm only 14, but farm work pays well. Well, there you go, quick queue. Keep at it. Where's the park at? Down there. How long left farm is done? That's a great question. At the moment, though, I think what I might do is just. Uh, because I have a few different things I need to do and finish up some recordings, what we'll likely do here uh, is unload this and then possibly call it a day there. Hey, Captain Simulation, welcome along, buddy. How's it going? Thread the needle, don't it either, don't it either, yes. I think they're buying a Massey 5713, nice. Will that make a multiplay? A multiplay stream or a multiplay series? I have thought about it. I have a, a server that I do use for a few different things. Speaking of which, I need to actually do it, send out a message about that soon. Capcorn. I do like this John Deere combine with the tracks, it looks fantastic. We replace uh, now a JCB for a brand new one. Oh, nice.
Catch you later, Paul. Thanks for stopping by. Really do appreciate that. We will next be streaming likely on Sunday, unfortunately. It's going to be a little while away, but that's the closest I can do. Uh, what I'm going to do now is actually just take the combine up to the end of the field myself. Um, and then we'll call it quits once we get up there. I do believe Dave is just sorting out a few technical issues, so he will be coming live in just a moment or two. Corporate contracting is coming back. Yes, Paul. Uh, BF and I have been talking about some ideas for that. Uh, so we've got something in place that could work out very nicely indeed. Uh, so watch this space for that. Well, it won't be this week, I don't think, because the schedule in, but maybe next week. Tractors do you have within Fan Farm? We were Masseys. Masseys, uh, originally Fords to begin with, and then switched over to Masseys. Uh, with one case, a 956XL in there as well, for some reason. It's a bit of a tank of a thing to drive around. Okay. The way the baler. Absolutely, Edwin. Yeah, like it's the same. We're um, it's coming back soon. We problem was we struggled to get a good. Um, it was difficult to make it work as well as we wanted it to on Felsburn on the European map. So um, yeah, we've got a few ideas. But for now, what we'll do is, I think we'll just swing in here, we'll empty this out. Or as much of it as we can get into there before we're full. And that is going to call us a day there. I think we will leave it here now, guys. Thank you ever so much for watching. I do hope you have enjoyed. Uh, if you have, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to Simulation for the Nation if you've yet to do so already. We will be back probably, like I say, Sunday, I would think. Keep an eye on my Discord, though. I'll let you know if there's any more information. Links for which will be in the description down below. Uh, but for now, guys, thanks ever so much. I know Rainbow Dave is coming around the corner. He's just figuring out his technical issues. But we will see you later on. So have a great rest of your day. Enjoy the rest of the live streams. I'll be around for a few of them. Uh, and I shall see you all later.